Hi everyone, this is a look at hydrocarbon combustion. This is a very specific type of reaction where a hydrocarbon, a chemical that contains only carbon and hydrogen, reacts with oxygen to produce carbon dioxide, gas, and water, sometimes liquid water, sometimes water vapor. Hydrocarbons have one word names. These are your propanes, methanes, butanes, pentanes, octanes. If you don't know the formula, you can always find them in the data booklet. We need to be extra careful balancing the oxygen, and it's perfectly okay, I would even encourage you, to use a decimal if you need to. Here's our first example. It's methane reacting with oxygen. We have our hydrocarbon. It's just carbon and hydrogen reacting with oxygen, and we get CO2 and H2O every time. It's a reaction with oxygen and after the arrow on the right hand side as the products CO2 and H2O every time. All we really need to do here is balance the reaction. One carbon, one carbon, four hydrogens. So over here I need to put a two because two times two is four. The trick is let's be careful balancing the oxygen. The left-hand side of the arrow, these oxygens right here, are going to balance all of the oxygens on the opposite side. So how many oxygens in total are there on the right-hand side of the arrow? We have CO2. That has two oxygens in it. We have two H2O, which also represents two oxygens. So in total, on the right-hand side of the arrow, there's four oxygens. So here on the left-hand side, I must have four oxygens as well. So I just put a two right there to balance the equation. A hydrocarbon, C's and H's, reacting with oxygen. It's on fire. It's burning. It's undergoing combustion. We get CO2 and H2O. Here we have one carbon on either side, four hydrogens on either side, and in total, four oxygens on the left-hand side of the arrow, and in total, four oxygens on the right-hand side of the arrow. A second example, propane burns. What's propane? Look up the hydrocarbon in the data booklet on pages four and five. There's a nice table there. It's in alphabetical order. It won't take that long to locate propane. Propane is C3H8. It's burning. It's undergoing combustion. What is it? It's so reacting with oxygen to produce carbon dioxide and water. Look at that. I'm going to stand right here to block these chemicals. Look at that. It's O2, CO2, H2O every time. Let's balance. C3. Right there. Balance those carbons. Hydrogens H8. Something here, 4 times 2 is 8. Now, careful with the oxygens. The total on the left is going to balance the total on the right. Here, it's 3 times 2. That right there represents 6 oxygens. Here, 4 H2O, that represents 4 oxygens. So in total, on the right-hand side, 6 plus 4, 10 oxygens. So here on the left, I want a total of 10 oxygens. I'm going to put 5. 5 times 2 is 10. The hydrocarbon, C's and H's, reacts with oxygen. It's on fire. We get CO2 and H2O. This has three carbons on either side, eight hydrogens on either side, and a total of 10 oxygens on either side of the arrow. One more time. Pentane is combusted. Pentane. What could pentane be? Look it up in the data booklet. Pentane. is C5H12. It's combusted. It's on fire. It's a reaction with oxygen. to produce CO2 and H2O. Let's get to balancing. Five carbons. Five. 
Here's 12 hydrogens, 12. So this is 6. 6 times 2 is 12 with the waters. Now, let's think about the oxygens. Here, 5 times 2, that's 10 oxygens. And on the back side, 6 more. Total of 16 oxygens on the right-hand side of the arrow. So, 8 right there, 8 times 2 is 16. What I'm talking about here of, of using a decimal, if the total oxygens on the right-hand side works out to be an odd number, then it's okay to put a 0.5 here to balance the oxygens. In the long run, that's going to simplify our lives a whole lot. Hydrocarbon combustion is when a chemical with C's and H's, hydrocarbon, reacts with oxygen to produce CO2 and H. Look at how these are all the same, O2, CO2, H2O. The balancing is fairly straightforward, but we must be careful with our work with the oxygens. And I hope that helps.